What's up guys, it's Taja here back with another Last of Us Part 2 informational video and today I actually want to talk about why The Last of Us Part 2 could be the greatest selling PlayStation exclusive of all time. But before we get into today's news, if you guys could throw a brick at the like button unless you for 350 likes as well as subscribe to the channel if you're brand new for daily Last of Us Part 2 quality content. Without further ado, let's get right into today's video. So guys, right now there's reports floating around that The Last of Us Part 2 is the fastest selling game in pre-orders for a PlayStation exclusive ever in history. Now this has been floating around for a couple of days and I did see it but i was too busy actually making videos on the game itself and you know the actual gameplay and breaking things down that i didn't really want to talk on the news just yet but since you know i, I took the time i want to actually spread some light on this to some of my subscribers even though most of you already really know these reports are actually coming from binge cells over on twitter and pretty much this guy literally just gets data from sales of video games and like in the industry and just reports on it and he said on his twitter i can't go into details on this so believe me if you trust me i'm hearing the last of us part has broken all records for the fastest pre-order playstation 4 exclusive physical and digital and he has the quote you can't stop this which is what ellie says in the trailer now what's actually insane and crazy about this is i truly do believe this because i don't know about you guys but i wanted to get the ellie edition for this game and after I shut off my stream once they announced the pre-orders, I was kind of trying to make videos and I was taking the time to talk to another YouTuber and I was just chillaxing. And when I went to go pre-order the Ellie edition, it was gone. Like I could not find it. It was completely gone from everywhere. When I tried to go to GameStop, it was gone. I tried to go to Amazon, couldn't even find it. I tried to go to Best Buy, it was gone. Like it just was not anywhere at all to be found. So the next day, I actually decided to just grab the collectors just in case I miss out and I just just cannot find Ellie. And you know, I got the collectors edition and then you, you know what? It, it was sold out the next day I knew. Like I went to back and checked and the collectors was sold out everywhere as well so there's no more collectors editions there's no more la editions i did see a lot of people pre-ordering the game on the playstation like i have a lot of friends as in you guys have you guys added on my playstation and a lot of you guys are rocking the avatar that they give you so i know you guys pre-ordered that and um i know for sure that some people pre-ordered the, the it's just crazy like this game i truly believe that it's been pre-ordered that many times now guys let's let's break this down this game has been pre-ordered the most ever a playstation exclusive has ever been pre-ordered and we're still five months out from the release date which means this game has already had like it already has sales before the game even comes out and we do know god of war is the second best like fastest selling playstation game with 3.1 million copies in three days and then we have spider-man which is 3.3 million copies in three days well if we already have the last of us 2 being the fastest pre-order game and we still have five months out that means whenever this game actually comes out we're gonna have so many sales so many sales from like from day one to three i'm pretty sure this game could easily hit four to five million and just completely just bombard and break the record completely like that that would be insane wouldn't that be crazy four to five million cells do you guys let me know in the comments right now do you think four to five million cells is plausible that is crazy okay that is insane now that we talked about that i want to add one more little thing onto this video and that's about like the multiplayer for the last of us 2 a lot of people keep asking me about the multiplayer and the factions mode and what i think and honestly i'm not on the side of you know the raging and going crazy on naughty dog about it i'm not petitioning the game i don't care really that the game's not having multiplayer i did play the multiplayer in the first game i enjoyed it but Honestly, multiplayer gaming just isn't the same to me anymore. I don't really enjoy it that much anymore. So at the end of the day, I'm all about my story mode games. I'm all about the story. And The Last of Us Part 2 not really having a multiplayer truly does not bother me at all. So yeah, that's my opinion on the whole multiplayer situation. Now, if you guys didn't know, multiplayer is actually coming. Um, there was actually somebody who came out and did a whole like Twitter thread about how multiplayer will be returning and that here is loud or whatever. So yes, multiplayer will be returning. I don't. It's not coming in the sense of part two though. Multiplayer will not be in you know, part two, but there will be like maybe like a standalone game for factions or something. So yeah, that will definitely be happening for sure. Probably. I still. I don't think I'm a buy honestly though. I don't think I really care enough to get it. But I mean, you know. I'm all down to play, you know, The Last of Us 2. That's what I'm all about. I'm all about the story and Ellie's journey, and that's what I'm really focused on. That's all we have to talk about today. That's the news for today, and that should pretty much wrap things up. Now, if you guys haven't already, you guys should actually go follow me on Twitter at Taji Moment because I do give you guys daily updates over this game more on a casual level. And, you know, I like to post pretty cool things. I like to talk to a lot of you guys, and it's a nice little viewer Taji interaction. So go ahead and follow me over on there. I also want to let you guys know that I do have some different videos coming up. Uh, I do, of course, have more news that I have to cover, but I'm going to space it out 
out a bit. So I'm gonna be a little bit late to some of the news because I actually wanna, you know, cover the game more and actually get more into the gameplay that they showed us and break more things down, such as characters, go through the story, like what went over the story so far. You know, pretty much just actually break down the game itself other than just talking about news. Cause we've been talking about news for this game for five months. You know, I wanna actually talk about the game now that we actually, you know, got like a buttload of information about the game itself. So yeah, that's where this channel is gonna be going for the next couple of days, next couple of weeks or so. And then we will be going heavy on news again. But yeah, if you guys could go ahead and throw a brick at the like button, let's shoot for 350 likes as well as subscribe to the channel for daily Last of Us Part 2 quality content. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another banger.